Right, just down that track there, I've got some fish feeding on the surface in mid-March. It's not cold, it's nice and warm, and they're not really playing ball. It's going to be really finicky, this. I've been feeding them probably for about an hour, and I have had a, just a two or three taken, just very gently. Often missing the bait when they're going up and approaching it, but um, I'm going to try and get a little bit of filming done. I've just got me little stalking rods, me actually, my little boys' rods in the, in the van here. They're not massive carp, but there's some pretty ones in amongst them, so hopefully, fingers crossed, I'll get one for you. The wind's blowing up into this lovely little corner. And I have seen quite a few fish down there. They're not very big, but it's a great sport to try and get one off the surface in mid-March. Let's give it a go. Right, the wind's blowing the floaters a little bit, and there's loads of fish right over on that bank there, as opposed to casting across to them. I'm just going to mooch around and try and keep as quiet as I can. Just see a really pretty fish just now. Looked absolutely stunning. I don't know if you can see them out there. There's a whole group of them that we just rolled in. There's quite a few there now. Rather than putting a control on, I'm just going to free line over that bank. Bait's been drifting in there all the time. I should have known better. The other one's just rolled down there. It's me been fishing in open water for the last 20 minutes or so. And that's where they've been sneaking about down here. Just off that branch, there's a lot of fish now. So we can get a take on film. It's a pretty linear. Superb. Cats are found your us. <laughs> a stunning little mirror, just stalked from down the edge. Mid-March and catching fish like this off a surface is absolutely awesome. Really chuffed with that. Over and done with pretty quick. Well done, Pink.